starting off with my door, I have this cute card holder I got from my, a friend who is from India and I also have this random stuff hanging from it. So I'm just going to go in and I'm gonna close the door so people are not gonna talk. And first thing here on my room is this big mirror. Hello. And it's not really big, it's like this tall. And it's just, uh, it's not fixed on the wall, it's just laying against it because I like to move it around. And it also makes the room looks, look a bit, little bit bigger, which is nice. And first thing you see when you come into my room is my work desk and my study desk. And here I made a couple of videos about it, if you guys want to check it out. And I'm gonna make some videos separately for each part of my room. Like, I'm gonna make like a tour for my desk, my vanity, my wardrobe and stuff like that. So here it's just gonna have, uh, just gonna be a room tour. So. Coming here, I have a little plant and on the side I have a trash can which I use to dump my papers and things like that and over here I have a culture on this box like thing and then over here I have my mini Polaroid wall I really like this part of the wall and it's great because it's not an actual picture, it's like a artsy filter. So all the pictures have this artsy filter and I change the pictures every year. Moving on over here, I have this little grid copper thing, which holds little gifts I got from the mother of my boyfriend that I forgot the name in English. And it's hanging from these little clips and this thing that stuck on the wall right here and it also has this little pepper thingy that I absolutely adore and I think it's so cute on the side there are my two shelves that are on top of my bed and unfortunately for my boyfriend these shelves are a little too short so he always bangs his head on the lower one. A good tip is to make sure your boyfriend fits under the shelves, but it's too late now. Anyway, here I put some decoration. I bought this uh, in a local store. It's yoga figures, so they are made of porcelain, I think. And here on the back, there's a little house. This one I got from France, a trip I made to France. And I think it's really cute. This cactus I got from my grandmother and it's thriving over here. These two plates are from different places. This one is from Mexico and this one is from Argentina. This little thing here I got from my brother who went on a trip here in Brazil and this picture over here it's actually a drawing I got from Disney it was the second trip I made in my life to the uh, to go abroad so I went to the United States and I went to Disney so I bought this little figure I think this was in 2011 probably here I have another uh, porcelain thing that I got as decoration and this is from another trip I made to the United States and over here if I can open it I cannot open it so I managed to open it it's a little apple how cute is that they actually have a little apple inside the New York City uh, decoration over here I got some shells from trips I made across Rio and over here is just a cute little glass 
container with some uh, tiles from my bathroom that fell off and I need to put them again. So they're just decorating my room right now. Over here I got this cute um, wood figure for arts and I like how it looks on the shelf. That's the only reason why I got it, but okay. And I love to add plants to my room, so I have a couple of them. This one being the biggest one aside from that one over there. And I really like how it looks on the shelves and I can also put the leaves over here, like falling off the shelf, but I prefer it to be like that. And over here I have another little house that I got from the same trip I was talking about. And under it there are my that I just put up yesterday. And I think they really complement the shelves and the bed itself. Now to the second shelf up there, I have two plants. And on the middle I have this beautiful uh, Patagonia picture that I got on the first trip I made abroad, which was to Argentina. And I absolutely loved this picture and I love dogs, so I had to put it in my room, that's why it's here. And this was in 2010, so nine years ago already and the picture is still looking great. Even if, even though I was a child, I think I, I took care of my things well. <laughs> Moving on to my bed. So I just recently upgraded my normal bed to this double bed or full bed. I don't know exactly what you call it. And I absolutely love this. There's so much space. And I didn't actually buy this bed. I got it from my parents. My parents upgraded their beds and I got this one for myself and it has some compartments on the bottom so it has four drawers which I use for uh, covers and th stuff like that this is what it looks like now moving on to my vanity which is over here it's not a very big vanity but I absolutely love it and it's very functional let me see if I appear here. Hello. So over here I keep my watch that I basically use every single day. So it's just here on top of the vanity. Over here this is a back uh, massage thing. It's very nice to roll on your back and just relax. Another little plant. These plants they don't die. Somehow I don't put water on them and they don't die. For here I have some perfume and water bottle and some boxes from my jewelry and stuff like that. Over here I have my brushes and also a picture of me, my boyfriend and that bowl, which I personally love. Over here there is a little bonsai, which I think is dead, but I'm trying to revive it somehow. And over here there's a couple more makeup drawers and stuff like that. And I'm gonna make a separate video on a vanity tour, just so you know and don't ask me about it. And the last thing I have is this round mirror, circle mirror, which I love. It looks so good with the vanity. I'm just trying to figure what I'm gonna put on top of the mirror because the wall is kind of empty and I don't know it looks okay but I wish there was something else over there anyway here are my windows my windows are quite big like they occupy this whole wall almost and I have my curtains which I bought for a very low price and Yes, my walls are dirty. Over here, here I have these little elephant uh, cord with lots of elephants. I just think it's cute, so I just hanged it over here. And now I'm gonna show the last side of my room, which is my wardrobe. And it occupies basically the whole wall over there. 
it has a little uh, some holes around it because we're still fitting the wardrobe properly into the wall so don't mind those and I'm gonna do a separate video on a wardrobe tour as well I have this big wardrobe because uh, everyone from my family puts their stuff in here so basically we have to have this big wardrobe anyway let's just end this video I hope you guys enjoyed this room tour and if you did make sure you leave your like and don't forget to subscribe and check my other videos. See you!